Hey you everyone, welcome to the History of Football channel. Today I'm going to be doing a match day vlog between Middlesbrough and Bournemouth. This match is being played at the Riverside Stadium. I'll be heading over there shortly. Uh, Bournemouth are currently second on the table at the moment, but they're winless and third. As for Middlesbrough, they sat just outside the playoff positions. A win today will keep them in the same type of area. For Bournemouth, a win for them will take them to the top of the table momentarily. Uh, for this match, I'm going to go for Bournemouth to win two goals to one. I think that uh, Middlesbrough, when it comes to playing teams that are out of form or not playing so well, they seem to play them back in the form. But we'll see how we go. I'm going to be heading over there shortly, so stay tuned for the rest of this match day vlog. All right, catch you then. So, just currently waiting for the bus at the moment. As you can see, it's... Uh, not very good weather at the moment, very foggy. It's about uh, one or two Celsius outside, so it's going to be very cold inside the ground, but uh, just waiting for the bus at the moment. So I just arrived in the borough now, it's about an hour and a half until kickoff. I might get a coffee or something at place before the match starts, but uh, heading over there now. So here I am at the Riverside Stadium in Middlesbrough. It's about 25 minutes to kick off. I'm still going to go for Middlesbrough to not win this match. I think Bournemouth will win 2 1. But uh, there's quite a few people in today. Should be a good crowd and uh, should, be, should be a good match, hopefully. So let's just see how that pans out. Have you?
History Football Channel. I just got back home after the match. They finished one nil to the Bury over Bournemouth. I thought it was a good game overall. The first half, Bury come out the stronger team, but over that first half, Bournemouth started to tame the screws. They had some good chances. They should have scored at least two or three goals in that first half. They missed two sitters, so it was nil all at half time. Second half though, Middlesbrough played much better than Bournemouth. Um, they finally got a goal courtesy of a penalty and then after that they had a couple of other chances to seal the, the win um, there was a goal that they scored through the substitute Hernandez but that was ruled offside and he took his shirt off in celebration got booked for that and he also got a, a talking to the referee because I thought he um, swore at the referee there besides that um, Bournemouth really didn't offer too much and they did have one or two half chances in the second half, but nothing really um, concrete you could see. I, I tip my hat off to the supporters that, that made their way to the ground today. Apparently they left Bournemouth at one o'clock in the morning to get to the game at the Riverside there. The, the crowd was around about 16,000, 17,000, so a, a good turnout considering that it was, it was minus one out there today with heavy fog and all that. So. A very good turn out. I enjoyed the game. I got had some great seats. I had a good time, and uh, hope you enjoyed this same um, vlog as well, and, and some of the the video highlights that I put together. But this is a uh, history of football signing off, and I'll catch us all later in the next one. All right, tatty bye for now.